Greetings YouTube. Today is Sunday, February the 27th. And here's what I got for you today. Start off in Iran. Stuxnet has struck. I posted a bulletin about this last night. Iran has told inspectors it is unloading fuel from its Bushir nuclear reactor, a sign of major problems, a UN nuclear watchdog says. The reactor, completed only recently, was hit by the Stuxnet computer worm, which was specifically designed to target Iran's nuclear program. Russia has called for an investigation of the worm, saying it could have caused a disaster. We've known about Stuxnet for a while, if you've educated yourself. There's biological hazard in Hawaii concerning loss of jellyfish. Dead, washing up along the beach. People are getting stung. There's another nuclear event here. UK. Police and radiation experts were alerted after controversial Russian oligarch Boris Berezovsky was hit by a mysterious illness at his country estate in Britain. The 65-year-old billionaire felt so sick for a fortnight it was feared he may have been the victim of a radioactive poisoning attack similar to that which killed his close friend, former Russian KGB officer Alexander Litvinko. We all remember what happened there, so this is just the boys at the KGB messing around again. There's been lots of volcanic activity around Iceland recently. Volcano there may go again. There's been seismic activity again under St. Helens and now Saint, or uh, now Mount Rainier as well. USGS is becoming more and more unreliable as they're censoring quakes here and there, and it's pretty sad. Another thing I wanted to discuss today was that so, uh, space weather, minor solar activity continues. Here's the halo. I posted a video recently about these halos. And the one I posted well, was an oval shape. And they had an intriguing discussion on that. So you might want to check that out. As you can see, this one is a circle. Previously, I, had, I believe it was in Finland, it was an oval shape. A, strange, or a rare phenomenon. Here's something else. They found... a. Uh, New upcoming asteroid. This one is larger than PN9. We'll center on the comet here and we'll zoom in. Now this is close already. I believe it's at its closest on the first. No, the second. The second it's at its closest. Its orbit is similar to ours as well. And if you'll see it's coming at a pretty a sharp angle there. So keep an eye on the skies. We may see another meteor out there. Don't expect to hear about it on the news or most other places. 2011 DE5 is what this one is been named. And the measles continues. Lots of measles concerns now in the states. Be safe everybody.